welcome back to my channel so as y'all can see i did a twist on my hair let me drink my peppermint tea with milk in there we got a package from color pop i was so like confused like why is it in a box i how you usually put it in like package like you know how you order something from amazon one of those i'll put it right here so when I saw it was in the box, I'm like, uh, who told them they, they could send the box to me? It's like, nah. I'm using the end of this rat towel comb. <laughs> also, you guys like my hair? I love, I did two yellow butterfly clips in my two puff balls while I let the rest out. This is like, this is day four, this twist out. This side is basically, most of the curls are gone. So this is made in LA, okay? Oh, that's how the packaging looks, color pop. It's just so weird getting a box from them because, please don't mind this mirror. I'll put it down. It's just so weird getting a box from them because I usually get the package. I'm like, hold on. Okay, I'm going to move this. And, of course, color pop always gives you the like, paper with all your, all your stuff on here. So, it says, I got... Concealer, a brow pencil, foundation, and astral pennant. I already love that concealer, and I already love that brow pencil. The new thing is the eyeshadow palette and the um, what's it called? The foundation. So for this card, I got Resting Beach Face. <laughs> I love these cards because when I spray my face, which I forgot, I need to buy another one of these Mario Blessu cucumber. And I fan my face. I like to fan my face with this. I'm stupid. So I got the um, Precision Brow Pencil in black and brown. I recommend this one more than the um, Brow Boss. The Brow Boss is very unpigmented. Like, if you want more natural than that one, but they're the same price. But this one is way more pigmented. It's way better. Color pop no filter concealer. It looks the same. This is dark, deep dark 52. That's my shade that I always wear to prime my eyelids, put underneath my eyes, anything. That's my shade. So let me show y'all. Like I literally have two of them right here. Wait, are these the same shade? Now I got deep dark 54. That's what I like to use for like. The put on around my discoloration and this is the brighten. Let's see if they look any different. Nope. They look exactly the same. I know in the store, like in Ulta, when I saw the concealer in Ulta, it was, the bottle was matte instead of glossy. So I was like, hold up. This concealer is very good. It costs $6. Good for your bank account. So I will be doing a video testing out the foundation and eyeshadow palette. So today too so so the palette i got was sweet talk oh my god i love this packaging it's so nice whoa look at it it's so cute like i'm not throwing this box away then here's the back this is so cute ever since i saw this palette i wanted it i was like i gotta get this so now i'm gonna open it the thing with color pop palettes too is if you drop them the the it's not most likely it's not gonna break but the pan will pop out that's a thing because with my yes please palette i dropped it look my yes please palette is really dirty so don't don't mind look it's very dirty <laughs> the shades aren't in the right places see but i dropped this one and it broke of course but they're not in the right places. I put the image right next to it. They're not in the right places. Oh my god, this oh this looks so good. Wow, they color pop packaging is so good. This was what twelve dollars. Same on the box. It's uh, got the eyes in the corner. I love how it's like reflective, holographic. Oh, they really stepped up. They added the little plastic thing. The little plastic thing. Woo, color pop. Y'all really doing it. I got to keep this, though. I don't want to mess this palette up. So, it's a color pop at the top. You're pretty. Here's a close-up of this palette. 
get into this this looks so good oh my god them glitter shades oh my god oh my god i haven't been so excited about makeup in so long like I can't wait to, I can't wait to do this. I'm doing this today. Foundation. So when I went on the website and I tried to match myself, I chose Fenty Beauty and I chose 440 because that's the shade I wear right here. But 440 is pr look look how much I use about look how much I use and I'm about to say it's pretty light. It's a little light. I don't think it's my exact shade, but I feel like, I mean, y'all saw me with it before. I feel like it's a lip, the undertone is weird. That's what I think. This is the ColourPop No Filter Foundation. I forgot to tell y'all, I did buy the ColourPop No Filter Foundation stick. In the shade 197 Warm. Deep Dark 197 Warm. Let me show y'all a swatch. I don't use this at all. Like, look how, look how much I have. That's how much come in there. It looks so orange on me. looks so orange on me it don't look that bad right now but it oxidized orange so they recommended me 190 i think but i got 200 the dark 200 and then i was looking on other people i searched it out right after i bought it of course i was looking at other people videos and it was like it looked a little too light on them like this better not be too light but this one girl it looked right on her so i'm like okay this is super small like let me compare it to fenty size wise look how small it is well, how many milliliters is 25 and it's 32 in um fenty then let me compare it to the foundation stick it probably got more this is 9.5 grams 34 ounces 80 85 ounces let me compare it to this Clinique one that also doesn't match me at all. The lady told me it matched me because it was the darkest one. Clove don't match me. It's definitely not matching anybody darker than me. This is how many? One fluid ounce, 30 milliliters. So all these foundations, let me do one more, Maybelline. 375 this one is way darker but i used to mix it with um the clinic one to get my skin tone but sometimes i still look a little burnt not that looking at burnt is wrong but when you it don't look right when your foundation way too dark for you look like you're trying to do black face and that's not what i was trying to do um this come with one fluid ounce 30 milliliters so I'm gonna open it up and see if it smells. Mm, I don't really smell anything. If you guys wanna see me testing out these products, y'all better watch my next video. By the time this be out, it'll be linked in the cards above, I think, hopefully. Um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe down below for more, just like it. Um, more makeup videos will be coming. Your girl is coming back better than ever or whatever. Um, y'all about to get some looks. Hunty. So y'all better follow my um my makeup Instagram right here. It's gonna be right here. Because y'all about to be y'all about to be shook. Y'all about to be dead. Anyways. Bye bye. If y'all wanna see any more color pop hauls, I'll link one in the card above and in the description. Bye bye.